neighborhood park in Lodi is being overrun with homeless. The city is trying to come up with a solution, but may have to shut it down altogether. New tonight, CBS 13's Jennifer McGraw joins us now with more on these park problems. Tony and Trin, it's becoming a real issue because of illegal activity. The city had to remove barbecue grills because of bonfires and benches because of vandalism. Neighbors say something needs to be done. It's a city known for its fine wines, but the drive into Lodi may seem a bit bitter. It should be a gateway thoroughfare. It doesn't look like it when you've got tents and bikes and shopping carts. The American Legion backs up to Lawrence Park as you enter the city. This facility is should be sacred ground. It's not. It's Commander Mike Bennett says vagrants have run residents out, and it's been bad for business. The homeless are defecating, dumping their needles. Uh, building camps here. Even caught breaking in and just the other day throwing knives at this tree for target practice. We're just kind of fed up with it. The city has been trying for years to stop the abuse, even shutting down restrooms. Staff routinely would uh, would be picking up hypodermic needles and other drug paraphernalia. The director of Parks and Rec says they made a few recommendations to city council. One was adding a dog park. We got some pushback. The real problem is a lack of funding. Would require probably some type of investment to to construct the type of amenities that that would make the park more inviting to the community. But Bennett says making it a parking lot for the Lodi Grape Festival would be ideal. This problem will not go away until the character of this park is totally turned upside down and made inhospitable. He fears the character of the city will be tarnished if nothing's done. It's Lodi's future. You know, you can either seize it or just let it go to pot like so many other areas where the homeless problem has been allowed to blossom. The city is looking into putting up a fence around the park until it can come up with a feasible option. Well, as we know, the problem is not just in Lodi, but they've dealt with this issue before. And ironically, uh, this new problem with homelessness in Lodi comes with uh, this story from a few years back when they were awarded and recognized for a program to clean up homeless camps. In 2015, a civil grand jury found Lodi to be the only city in San Joaquin County to have a well thought out, coordinated approach to the homeless problem. City leaders told CBS 13 back in 2016 after the homeless returned that they are constantly working to find better solutions to that problem.